everyone. We, uh, welcome to 2035 eMobility Taiwan. So now we are at the booth of MTARC. So when it comes to future mobility, MTARC is no strangers. So today we have Stephen here to tell us how MTARC work and how um, MTARC bring all the supply chain together to create um, a collaboration together. Okay, thank you, Carol. Uh, I'm Stephen. Uh, today I, wa I want to introduce you the, about the operation of MTARC. Actually, MTARC consists of uh, five uh, major research institutes together. And uh, all together we work for the autonomous vehicle project. So as you can see here, is the wind bus. The wind bus is the latest uh, the design output from the MTARC. As we integrate all the, uh, the supply chain from Taiwan mm -hmm. and try to design and build this vehicle platform for the Taiwan uh, auto parts supplier. Mm -hmm. And so today we are intro we, we later we'll show you uh, some of our key player mm -hmm. from, from our, our industry. Okay, so we can say that MTAR really brings the best of best here. Yes. Okay. You can say that. Good. So now and we will take a look at um, this year's highlight exhibitings from their um, suppliers. So here we have some products. Um, they are like systems provided by Inventech. So Stephen, can you um, tell us more about uh, these products? Okay, the, uh, actually the first one is the telematic box, the T-box. Yeah, it combined it with the function to transmit all the uh, data back to our, our back end. So it's a 4G system inside. So we connect all the, all the data, we collect from the sensors and uh, then send it back to to our big phone. Also, it have the function of compress the data because all, all of the, the data from the sensor is, is very huge. Mm -hmm. So that's for, for the, the basic function for the telemetry box. And next one is the passenger information system. As, a, as you know, this is a minibus. We need to, to inform the passenger what's the station now mm -hmm. and what's the next destination. So that's the, they, they produce this the passenger information system. Mm. Bus. So these two already used in our wind bus. Okay, so this product really like make the data management easier. Yes. For yes, current, right. like for, uh, for all the current companies, yes. right? Yes. So Stephen, we can see there are like many components provided by the suppliers. So can you like um, give us a detailed introduction about each other? Okay, uh, the, this one is the ABS module from our partner, Bill Home. Machine works. Actually, before uh, Taiwan's the two wheelers, the supplier of the ABS system is only from Bosch or Continental. So, but but uh, Liu He Machine Work is the first uh, company to jump into this segment, and they right now they already uh, mass production the ABS module for two wheeler and three wheeler. And for wheeler, they are working now. I, I think the product will be launched in the near future. Mm. That's for the ABS module. So that was like quite an achievement for Taiwan. Yes, yeah, so it uh, and reached the same level as the global uh, player, such mm. as the Bosch or Continental. Mm, good. Okay, uh, the next one is the Alpha. Uh, they, they, this is the mini mini wave radar. As you can see, there are so many uh, sensors right now on, uh, on, on the vehicle. And uh, for the blind spot detection, before they are always use the, the camera or the 25 gigahertz radar. But right now they offer the alpha offer the 77 gigahertz product for the for the automobile use. So already the export supply to the I think Japan and China and many uh, key uh, automakers already. Mm. It's a mass production product. Good. So how about this one? Okay, this one uh, from the gigabyte. It's a, I see, you, you can see it's a, a computer. Actually, the base is an industrial computer. Mm. But they adopt some of the, the automobile labels, the, the solution. So right now you can see it's an autonomous driving uh, solution platform. Mm. So it can control the autonomous bus. Right now already used inside the wind bus. Oh, so as you can see, there are like more interesting technology you can find here at the MTARC booth. So just visit 2035 eMobility Taiwan and you can learn more about the um, MTARC and also their suppliers and the technology as well. Thank you so much.